So um, I apologize about all the interruptions. Um, past couple episodes, I've been doing a lot of community work, I'm running around and everything like that. But um, I had a little bit of time here chilling in the uh, studio. I want to kind of finish up on some of the stuff that I was teaching you guys because I got a lot of episodes to drop. So um, as I was telling you guys yesterday, so yeah, like the whole, they're getting real upset because I've been monetizing on a real high level. So like now when I come to cities, like when I was in Cincinnati yesterday, they totally just turn, when I say they, I'm speaking of the corporate aspect of the city. When you come to a city, there's a corporate aspect of it, and then there's an aspect of it that's controlled out of what's called Herd County. And I was teaching you guys about that earlier, and that's what's going on with the latest ones. So the latest ones, they dropped it on Herd County or whatever, the Catholic Church, right? So these people are running around here and getting their heads. Their heads are all in the clouds because they think they got all of this money because they're the ones holder. And I refuse to be on the side of the Cardinals as far as being the ones holder, I refuse, even though I've already visited them, like we've already visited them. When I say I, I'm talking about my channel and people that help us and support us and things of that nature, we've already visited them. Like to me, like it's already over or whatever. So like you can boast to say that you're the ones holder, but Chicago already visited you. You see, because it doesn't, when you deal with sports, and this is why I was kind of trying to teach the, the uh, people that support the Reds, and things of that nature because they used the reds against us yesterday and they made the reds uh when i say they essentially they like invested so much money to where they made the red scores go to what's called zero they didn't score any points so it's zeroed out and the phillies scored what like some a certain amount of points like four points or something like that so they were just trying they did that though and it may sound unbelievable but they did that because i was in that area had I not been in that area in Cincinnati, they would not have zeroed them out. They're trying to claim that what I'm doing has been defunded and things of that nature. But they don't realize that I made so much money and us, the people that support us. And I'm going to give you proof in a minute. We made so much money through YouTube that we're now funding baseball. When you study the records, we could prove the, high, the, the, the top record, which is like 77 wins. Or the bottom record, which is like they got like 83 losses. We can verify and prove both of them. Why? Because every day we drop the video and it's too late now. So don't try to come on here and talk about whatever you want to talk about. Because I know a few people have been making comments like don't donate any money to 13 Sounds Astrology at Gmail at PayPal.com. He's a con artist and this and that. But every this is how I'm going to prove to you that I own. So I don't need to go through a baseball team to win. See, some people, they got to bet and go through a team, like some businesses. But I make so much money every day that I don't have to go through no team. I own every team, even the Guardians. When I say I own, I'm speaking of records. The reason why they changed the Cleveland Indians to the Guardians because of the Golden Knights and my investors out in Vegas. I knew about that before it even happened last year. I own. So I was explaining that to them or whatever. So like the record which is the top record is like to get into the door of this investing is 59 wins. Meaning that if you not, if you got to drop a video, what if you drop a video like every day for like five days straight, every day though, you got to at least get 500 or more 590, excuse me, or more views at this point. I've already done that. You got to do that for at least 25 videos straight. So I've already done that. So I own on my own and people that donate to me on their own, because not only is it just that it's not about the views. I don't have an ID. So when I come in, I can come in as a secure party creditor, man. And they hate it. It's so scary to them because I don't need to have a lot of views. Like I'm going to give you a video, give you some proof, but we're getting ready to produce over 100 million views. That's what I'm, all I'm going to say on YouTube through this channel. We're going to be getting ready to produce. 100 million views. That's what I'm saying. I can't tell you how much it's worth or anything like that, but you'll see it through monetization and units. Produce now. So I don't have to, like, receive anymore. I'm not on that level anymore to where I have to, like, wait as far as, like, for people to watch me and stuff like that. I don't have to. That's, like, receiving. I give. So you got to give, and I figured out how to do that. It's a multi-level thing, and they don't understand it. Once you make a certain amount of money in this world, the rules change. You could just buy off the bar. 
Yeah, some people got to get 5,000 views in their first video. I've already done all of that. My highest video is over 100,000 views. Not bragging about it, but I did that a long time ago, and they haven't visa that. That's all I'm saying. See, I count. So anybody can get a million views, 20 million views, a billion views. But this is what I do for people. I was working with somebody that's got a billion views, right? I was working with Katy Perry. And this is what I do for people. I teach you how to get money out of that. They're not going to teach you how to do that. How to get a money out of a billion views. Nobody's really yet. Yeah, this is the beautiful thing and the scary thing about YouTube is deep. And a lot of the viewership companies online is that nobody's really um, received their full check yet. And it's their fault because you don't know how to get it. So I come up with more. We're talking strictly about that, though. We're going to talk about on this new episode, we're going to talk about the views and um, what I'm exactly speaking on, like how I'm going to fund it or what I did to fund it. Like, like we did this in our 20s, like we funded and we mine. It's called monetization. Anything that's left over goes into mints. So we did this stuff in our 20s when we was up in New York. You can only do it if you got ties to New York. And we funded a certain amount of what's called mints. And the only way to get access to that, I'm not going to stop there because I don't want to spoil it for you. It's very deep. But I promised her, I was like, people say they want to go to the moon. And the girl from Cincinnati said that she wanted to go to the moon and I promised her. So now it's there. What are you going to do? The only way to get those millions of views is to go through the moon. See, that's what they don't realize. You want to get those rap views, you got to go through the moon and travel and get credit through the moon. We'll come up with more. I'm going to stay, stay vigilant.